who is a diehard Leafs fan. He has come a long way. From being a semi-permanent fixture at the bar and sometimes football player to a permanent fixture at the bar and board member with a court date. You have come a long way, my friend. Then we have Mark Cox. Actually, Bulls is more like the appropriate family name for this lad. <coughs> his ankles are the size of his calves, thus the term cankles. <laughs> Has a suppressed desire to be a bar girl as he loves to get dressed into their garments, dance on stage, and get a swim in the aquarium if any. <laughs> Favorite is black or red song with glitter. <laughs> this is all pre-Gina, of course. <laughs> now it's even worse. As you notice, no skills pertaining to football were mentioned. <laughs> Kevin Moylan, sad that he's not here with us tonight. Tough lad, love to listen to his stories, especially when he starts saying nice things about people. An Irishman who is fluent in Tagalog but speaks it with a Thai in innotation. Intonation, sorry. This is even before he was based in Bangkok. There was a time I should have known that life in nomads will be different from the moment Kevin met his new employee, but it sort of crept up like a fog in the horror film The Mist. Before we knew it, it was too late. His name was Colin Mackay. <laughs> there are legendary stories about this man, but since there are kids here, I would not dare say. But sooner or later, this urban lender will be known to you, folks. Now we go to Andy Yates. <laughs> he started off as a nice and quiet, quiet lad. Believe it or not, he just played football and did not have a mouth on him. You say no, it's true. Through the many years of living in the Philippines and moving up in the corporate world, becoming a proper expat, being football selection captain, and later on, into his head. From ref whisper talk, remember who's cleaning your shoes, man. <laughs> to sort it out, or I'm gonna take the trophy back and erase you from the record. <laughs> to my favorite, as I was deciding on the pitch when they said it, ref, get a grip, or I'm gonna turn the light. <laughs> a true gangster in form, from hacking people on the pitch to a plan that has gone all wrong in a team huddle. From that big Singaporean drove, drove towards trouble, to which Andy with conviction said, I'll have him the fastest. <laughs> but getting the broken nose instead. <laughs> there is a saying, to test a true character of a man, you give him power. Obviously, Andy failed. <laughs> Tony Tiktok Bambro, former goalkeeper, Manchester United supporter. This guy is like American Idol Simon Cowell. It's either you love him or you hate him. Sometimes that love-hate relationship can happen in one night. Ask Hodges or Jennifer. They will tell you. Is what he thinks is a no-nonsense attitude which, without tact, gets him in trouble all the time with fellow footballers, especially wives of nomad members, <laughs> and more recently, a group of strangers that were mustache-bearing 